Hello and welcome back to another video. Now this one's a little different. I've decided to do a new series based around this Premiership Fantasy Rugby from the Rugby Magazine. I don't know if anyone's heard of them. Uh, they've been going for five years now, but there hasn't really been a standout fantasy game uh, for, for the Rugby Premiership. Like FPL, if anyone's heard of that, the uh, Football Premier League is huge on YouTube and, and with everyone. So I thought let's start my own Premiership Fantasy Rugby series. So each week I'll be going through my team and trying to pick the best players and hopefully we can interact with each other through this. So here we are on the Rugby Magazine's Fantasy Rugby. Obviously you can see it says Premiership and Six Nations. I'm just going to be focusing on the Premiership, obviously because it starts in a month's time. But if there's enough interaction with the series, then of course I can do a Six Nations. So just under the Premiership one, you can see these little icons. Uh, the first one is your dashboard, so I'm going to click on that and it's going to take us to our dashboard. As you can see, I've called my team Class on Grass. Uh, that's just something I've always done in these little fantasy leagues. And if we scroll down, we can actually see uh, this little preseason stat. So the most signed player is actually Marcus Smith. So this is a nice little insider for anyone who's new to the game, uh, like me. And you can also see the game week one fixtures. So you can pick players based on who they have, uh, I mean, in their first game week. And also, you can see here the preseason dream team. So this is in each position. The most selected player so as you can see marcus smith is obviously the most picked 10 with 65 percent of people on this game picking him so there's just some really useful information here for you to just start building your teams and a few more useful things down here it actually tells you the bans and injuries so people that you shouldn't probably put in your team because obviously they're unavailable so yeah your dashboard is probably one of the most important ones it just tells you the overall things that are going on and who else people are selecting and like I just said the injuries and brat bans for the people you don't want to pick. So it can really help you choose your team for each game week. So another useful tab on here is the players tab. So this is where you can actually see how much the players are worth and you can start actually adding people in into your team. So I just recommend going on it, having a little look. It does seem quite complicated with all the stats and numbers but to be fair, there's lots of sorting here. Um, you can see Maka Vunapola is the most expensive. But like I say, just, just get your head around it. Go, go to the website and go on it. And just start getting a real feel for it. So now we can go into the leaderboard section of the Fantasy Leagues. And this is where you can see how you fare against the overall people on the game. Or you can actually set up private leagues, which is what I'm actually going to do right now. So I'm going to create my own JG Rugby League. Um, so yeah, let's call it JG Rugby uh, Fantasy League. And yeah, you're, everyone's more than welcome to to come onto it. So if if you watch my videos and you think, oh wow, this is actually quite interesting, I'll, I'd like to like to have a go at this. I'll put all the links down in the description so that you can just go and click, and also come join my league so that we can interact and see if you can beat me. If you want more in detail videos about this, the Rugby Magazine's fantasy leagues, then the Rugby Magazine actually have a YouTube channel and they've got all the explainers on there and they'll definitely be far better than I can ever, ever try. Obviously, this is my first time on the, on the fantasy league. So yeah, go over there, go to their website, have a go at it, just interact with everything. Um, yeah, and if you're keen, have a look at their YouTube videos to see how you can really prosper in the leagues. So there you go, I've created my own fantasy league. Of course, if you want to join, you can. I'll leave the links down in the description uh, just so they don't have to remember it and you can just click easily. So go down in the description and join my league. So within this fantasy league dashboard, you've got scout reports, which are basically insights for you. For the rugby magazine post. Um, I know that they've just posted two as we're getting close to the Premiership season. So go check it out um, and it'll just give you really good insights really. If you're struggling to build your team or you're thinking about changing one game week, you can go to Scout Reports and 
it can give you real good insight. So that's it from me for this video. Again, if you want more content on this, then please go in the comments and just tell me or hit the like button and hit the subscribe button as well. I'll probably be doing this all season. Um, and like I said, check out the rugby magazine for more insights and yeah, go down in the description and join my league. Hope you all enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.